This tutorial demonstrates you how to use geotagged photos to create KML file and open those geotagged photos into the Google Earth and ArcMap. As you know, digital cameras take videos and photos with metadata about the camera and its settings. Camera phones like iPhone and phones using Android operating system embed the data automatically. The most common way to embed data into an image file is using the exchangeable image file format that is also known as EXIF. So in nutshell, geotagging is the ability of putting GPS coordinates onto a picture. For this video tutorial, you will need the three things for geotagging. First, pictures taken from digital camera or camera phone with GPS coordinates. In case one of your photographs is not geotagged. Don't worry, you can geotag it. I will show you. Secondly, GeoSetter software that is freeware. And third, Google Earth that is also freeware. You can download GeoSetter software from this web page. It's freeware. And you can download Google Earth software from this web page. It's, it is also freeware. When you have installed with these software, copy all the geotagged images into a separate folder, open GeoSetter and navigate to the folder containing the images. As you can see that total four images are there in this folder but uh, last one this one is not geotag other three images shows the latitude and longitude in their photograph details but this photograph is not geotagged but i will show you how to geotag it for this what is needed just go to images menu and click on the edit data here you can see that latitude and longitude of this photograph is not in the boxes. But if you remember the exact location where you took this photograph on the earth surface, you can geotag this photograph. And for this, you have to open the Google Earth and navigate to the place where you took this photograph. In our example, I remember the location of this photograph is here so I am going to put a place mark here this is the location from where I took this photograph when you place the place mark the place mark dialog box shows the latitude and longitude of that place in decimal degree you can copy this data and paste it to here again copy the longitude and paste it here now click the OK and save the information now this photograph is also georeferenced now select all the images and click to export selected images to Google Earth to open the export to Google Earth dialog box check the thumbnail captions on custom select OK and navigate to folder and enter a name for the KMZ file Click on save button. Now the process is going on. Dialog box open that says, would you like to open it with Google Earth now? Click yes. Now you are all the four images are shown on this Google Earth. Click on thumbnail to see the image
The KMZ file can also be sent to your loved ones via email so that they can also view the photographs on Google Earth. Now, I will show you how to import this, these geotech photographs into the ArcMap. Open the ArcMap and in the search box just type the geotech click on the search button and you will get the geotech photos to point tool in the input folder navigate to the folder where you have put your geotech images add that folder click ok Now, the location of the images are shown in this arc map with point shape file. Go to the HTML pop-up and select the point and a pop-up window appears that shows that geotagged photograph. If you want to zoom it, click on it. And this is the photograph taken at that place that is being shown by point shape file. In the same fashion, you can click another point and get the image. Click on again next point and show the image. So following this procedure, you can import the geotag photographs as a point shape file into the ArcMap. Thank you for watching this video.